All right, let's cut to the chase. Guardians of the Galaxy Mission Breakout doesn't just compete with the Tower of Terror, it absolutely crushes it. Now, before you start drafting your angry comments, still make them, just hear me out first. Let's take a thrilling journey into the heart of these two Disney Titans in our first ever Ride Rumble Showdown. Well, hello there. My name's Jeremy, and welcome back to Freeform Disney. All right, let's dive into the great debate. Guardians of the Galaxy Mission Breakout versus Tower of Terror. And if you've got any other rides you want me to compare in the future, let me know down below in the comments. Now, I've been on both of these rides more times than I can count, so trust me, I've seen it all, right? Let's start by taking a trip down memory lane, back to when I first braved the Tower of Terror at Disney World. It was a different era. I was younger, and admittedly, a tad more easily spooked. The Twilight Zone theme was intriguing, and the drops? Downright hair-raising. And oh, so much fun. You better bet I rode that numerous times. Now let's jump to my initial encounter with Mission Breakout. I approached it like a skeptical cat, wary but with a ton of curiosity. How on earth could it stand up to Tower of Terror, right? But man, it, it caught me off guard. I was hoping, but oh, my doubts started melting away in the lobby, and by the time Rocket wrapped up his hilarious pre-show banter, oh, I was there for it, and mm, once that ride was finished. Hi, right, let's contrast the two. So the Tower of Terror carries a captivating thriller aura. It's chilling, it's exciting. But Mission Breakout? It's just a blast. It's not just about the thrill or the chill. It's about the fun, the energy, and that wild galactic MCU vibe. Design-wise, I give credit where it's due. Tower of Terror has the superior exterior aesthetic. It's imposing, it's mysterious, but that said, step inside and Mission Breakout shines. The collector's cases in the lobby? Absolute genius. As for the waiting rooms in that pre-show area, well that one, that's a tie. Both do an impressive job of immersing you into their unique themes. And then Tower of Terror gets one last point into the design with the boiler room, which certainly works better for it than it does for Mission Breakout. Music? Tower of Terror is atmospheric and it's eerie driving home the chilling theme. But Mission Breakout is the clear winner. The tracks are not just fun, they're absolutely electrifying. They make you want to jump back in line the moment you get off. And the fact that the ride changes with each track, both in feel and drops, pure genius. It's not just background tracks, it's a high-energy soundtrack that practically thrusts you into the Guardian's world. And speaking of their worlds, how about characters and storyline? Tower of Terror has its intrigue and brings a neat, albeit pretty thin, narrative. The Guardians, they're top-notch. You really feel their presence and the different scenes you can run into definitely adds to it. Oh, and Rocket? He totally steals the show. While both Tower and Mission Breakout work in their own world, this category clearly goes to Guardians. And by the way, best scene? Baby Groot and the big red gravity button. However, let's not disregard one of the Tower of Terror's most iconic features, the Mirror Room. It's a stroke of genius, a suspense-filled moment that heightens the anticipation for what's to come and helps bring you as the audience into the ride. And it's this very feature that makes the Tower of Terror more mysterious and thrilling, giving it an easy point over Mission Breakout's generator room which we blow up. So with all that comparison done, it comes down to a ride rumble between the two and Mission Breakout takes the title. Hands down. The theme, the energy, the music, the ride and scene variations. It's not just a ride, it's an entire spectacle. And even though I've yet to ride Tower of Terror at Disney Tokyo Sea, I'm pretty confident it couldn't topple Mission Breakout, at least in my books. The more I ride Mission Breakout again and again, the more it wins me over. I just, oh, I love going on to it. I'm just excited to run right back in there. I like going on Tower of Terror. I'll do it again and again. But if I'm being honest, I think I enjoy the ride more than I do the theme on Tower of Terror. So yeah, Mission Breakout, like being sucked into a Guardians of the Galaxy movie. Fun, zany, full of laughs, and the music elevates the experience, you could say, to another dimension. So next time you find yourself at Disneyland Resort, head over to California Adventure and give Mission Breakout a shot. You might just find yourself as blown away by it as I am. 
But hey, whether you're plunging into the Twilight Zone or blasting off with the Guardians, you're in for a wild ride. Now I want to hear from you. Do you agree with my verdict? Or is the Tower of Terror your unbeatable champion? Maybe you've got a couple of rival rides you'd like to see in the ring. Let me know down below in the comments. And thanks for joining me on this thrill ride of a video. If you had as much fun as I did, give that like button a click. Know a friend who'd love the Ride Rumble? Don't hesitate to share. And remember to subscribe so you won't miss out on our next showdown here on Freeform Disney. And until then, have a magical day, and may the Force be with you for all time, always.